Alright, uh, today I'm going to be showing you guys how to record videos on your iPod Touch. And you have to have this jailbroken. Uh, if you have iOS 6.1.3, you cannot jailbreak it. You have to have iOS 6.1.2 or lower. Alright, first off, you have to go to Cydia. And you're going to have to add a source. I will put the link in the description below. If you guys can hear my dog whimpering in the back, he can't jump off my bed, and he's scared. So, yeah. Alright. You're gonna want to go to Manage. Wait. Here. Manage. Sources. Then you're gonna want to add cydia.xlize.com. After you do that, you go to search, then you want to type in display recorder. And all your, if you have iOS 6.1.2, you're going to want to have the XLize one. There are three other ones, but they don't work with my iOS version. Other ones work with like iOS 6. Point, no, not 6. Uh, 4 or iOS 5. I have iOS 6, so I would click on this one. And then you're going to want to download it. I already downloaded it, so I'm not going to go through that again. So yeah, after that, you're going to have to restart your springboard. And then you'll get this icon. It has a red dot over it because I'm recording right now. And after that, you just... It's pretty simple, oh, but uh, if you're going to want to upload it to your YouTube account, you're going to want to go to Settings, and in Settings, you're going to want to scroll down until you see Display Recorder. Click on that, go all the way down. And YouTube account, you just fill in your account information, username, password, and it will just upload it to YouTube, as I'm going to do. And how you set it up, you're going to want to turn the frame, rame, fr frame rate all the way up. And video format, you're going to want to put H264 with mic audio, so then you could talk. Video quality, you could put it on high, low or medium. I'm having it on medium so that will have faster frame rate. After that you pretty much don't have to mess with any of the grayscale or scales. Show taps, you could when recording. I have mine set to medium. You could have it hidden or always. Tap size, you can choose the tap size you want it. See mine is a lot bigger now. Now it's a lot smaller. I'm just gonna set it back to medium. After that, it will just link to your YouTube account. Then, I'm going to go to Display Recorder. And, I'm not sure if it will still record after this or not. But, I can't show it to you because I'm recording. But, it's pretty simple. Just click on the video after you recorded it. And, it will give you a list of options to delete it, play it, or upload to YouTube. So, there we go, guys.